where we begin with that story out of Harlington. A baby's body found in a bag in a reservoir there. That discovery made this morning in what's called Bristol Reservoir 4. And tonight, the state dive team searching the water there looking for any other evidence. News 8's Bob Wilson on that scene live tonight with the very latest. Bob? We want to give you an idea of what divers are working with the conditions here. You can see the ice covering this reservoir here. This is actually one reservoir down from reservoir number four. They have that completely blocked off because they are diving in there. They are looking for evidence right now, and they don't want the public going in there. As a matter of fact, Route 72 goes right through reservoir number four, and you can see clearly on both sides the reservoir and what the dive team's doing. So they've just shut it all down as they look for evidence. Right now, we don't know a whole lot other than it is a baby. We don't know the age. We don't know the gender. And we also just know that it was found in a plastic bag. We don't know if it was found in the water, if it was found on that road or on the banks, or if it was found out on the ice. But it was found by a water department worker who was there to check the reservoir. Now, the reservoir has been offline, and they say it's going to stay offline for now. The City of Bristol Water Department consulted with the Connecticut Department of Health. Uh, they have determined that the reservoir has not been used in a couple days and will remain offline. Well, right now, the dive team will collect whatever evidence, if they can find any evidence. They say they're treating this as a suspicious death for sure at this point. The body will be taken to the medical examiner's office, and the medical examiner there will do the autopsy to see if they can figure out exactly what happened, how the baby died. That's what's going on here in Harmington. I'm Bob Wilson reporting live, News 8.